How to unbox and assemble your new Unero Spectre S. Open the box and with the help of a friend, pull the bike out of the box. Your bike arrives 90% assembled and will be on the trails in no time. With the bike secured on a flat surface, remove the packing material from the bike. You can use tools to do this, but be careful not to scratch the paint. The handlebars are assembled too. We'll start by putting those on. Inside the box you will find a toolkit, manual, charger, rear light, and in case you miss it somehow, the front tire. Let's start by rotating the stem forward. Use the included three-prong multi-tool to loosen the stem pinch bolts. Turn the stem forward. Line it up to point forward with the front fork and tighten this down. Next, open up the handlebar clamp with the multi-tool. Place the handlebars inside the open clamp and be aware of the cables, that they don't get twisted and shorten the reach of all the controls. Tighten down all four bolts in front of the handlebar clamp. Next, remove the through axle between the front fork. The two sides of the fork can rotate independently, and that's okay. Have a friend help you pull up on the handlebars to give you space to align the front tire into position. Be careful to slide the brake disc, which is attached to the wheel, into the center of the brake caliper on the fork. Use the multi-tool to tighten this as well. Next, attach the front light and reflector assembly onto the crown of the fork. Rotate the arm to be pointing up with the light pointing forward. Tighten this down with the multi-tool. Plug the light into the open cable. Next, let's attach the pedals. The pedal on the right side, meaning the driver's right side, threads in normally, tightening clockwise. The pedal on the left threads in backwards, tightening counterclockwise. Use the included 15mm wrench to tighten these down. Attach the included rear light by stretching the rubber around the seat post and hooking it to the other end of the light. Turn on your bike and enjoy. Be sure to check the tire pressure before heading out.